Now I have been able to download the Money Manager Expense and Budgets. So just click on Open. It's going to, okay, just allow, allow, then it's going to pop up now. So you can actually change the currency. It actually comes in USD. So you change it to Naira. Change to Naira, Naira, Naira. Oh, okay. Okay, this video is going to take a while. So, just for you to get it now. This is very important, you see. When you are adding, okay, for example, you want to add your income. Let's assume you are a salary earner. You can put income, a month, you earn 50,000 naira in a month. Category, salary. Account, you know your normal account, okay. Salary for March. Then you can put a little description here, but this is basically for expenditure. Then you save. So the total money you've had so far in March is 50,000 Naira. Then we go in, probably you went out on a date and you bought something, or you bought something from your household, then you click on this. Automatically, it's always on the expenditure side. So, okay, we spent 3,000 Naira. Category, oh, food. Account, from your account. Note, which is a, let's see, meal at spicy restaurant. One thing about this is, for example, if your category is not among here, you can actually create, you can add more category. You can see you can add more. But we are not doing that now. So we will stick with the food category. Then we save. Now, if you notice something, you see that, okay, total money we have less than 47,000. That is that. It means you are still within your income. This stat will now show you, okay, this is what you are spending money on. Currently, the stat is telling us, I've been spending 100% of my money, part of my expenditure is on food. So it's going to plot the graph just like that. If you use multiple accounts, is also going to do the conversion. So it's a nice one you can also use on our PC too. I hope this video is helpful. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.